welcome to uh, Dairy Birches. Try something different here with a maybe get some better audio for you guys. Whew. Hope everybody's doing all right today. If you're ready for some uh, Frank's Red Hot, I know I am. Today, I bet you're all wondering what I'm going to be doing with our lovely Frank's Red Hot. Hershey cocoa powder. What else can I do with that? You have to watch to find out. <laughs> My mic's running away. <laughs> there it is. Not the best idea I've had, but we'll make do, right? Maybe you can hear me a little bit better now. Stay. I'm not going to burn up up here. Alright. Add a little cocoa here. A little cocoa there. This could be something that actually works. Something you could use a recipe for. I don't know what for even. Maybe make a K starter or frosting. You spice heads out there, you might like a little bit of French red hot icing. But that would not make an icing today. kind of form this into a small paste if I can. I'll add some more if I have to. And I'm going to have to. I added a lot of cocoa powder. And there goes my mic. Gonna have to be generous with this stuff, right? Let's get it going. It's getting there. Not quite yet. I had it way too much cocoa powder. This is the uh, the winter one here, the sweet chili. This stuff is good on just about everything. <clears throat> I think it's mixed good. Another spoon. I'm gonna have to add a lot more to this. It's a little bit more runny, it's not as thick. Have to have more cocoa to it. 
any of you new guys uh, decide to try this for a dessert of some sort, send me a comment and let me know. You can even uh, find me on Facebook. And I'd like to see the creation that you make with it. You never know. I might try it. Boy, that looks good. That looks like milk chocolate right there. Don't smell as good milk chocolate. It smells like French. Let's try a little bit of it first. Just try some. And uh, we'll put it on some. So here's the French Red Hot Original with Hershey's Cocoa Powder. And I said chocolate, the cat meow, that's the cat's name. I'm not going to eat this cat. All right. That could work with something. It's a bit bitter, so then you got cocoa powder. It's got no sugar. But it's got potential. It's going to be something to be good. This right here is a lot thicker. Maybe I can add some more to this. Maybe a bit more. <clears throat> this one right here looks like milk chocolate, and this one looks like dark chocolate. It's the same cocoa powder. It's only getting thicker. But I bet this is going to be really good. Let's see how our champion sauce does. Uh, tastes like a really good sweet and sour, but it is flavored up. Everything I've tried so far, this stuff has been awesome on. So, uh, Feel free to use this anytime for anything. That. You don't need anything else. That is good. That is awesome. Let's try it on some donuts. Add a little bit of sweetness to it. So, <clears throat> Frank Red Hot Original, cocoa powder. On chocolate covered donut. Don't that look good? I'm shocked. That is really good. That is, that's, try that. Try this at home. Let me know you tried it. Let me know what you think about it. That is good. I'm willing to bet money this one is better. I know you guys are probably thinking, oh, he's not doing anything with it. Gross. Come on, I mean, really, who thinks about putting hot sauce into Hershey's cocoa powder? I guess we make hot chocolate. There's some spicy chocolates out there. But who puts French Red Hot into Hershey's cocoa powder and puts it on a donut? 
this guy. All right. It don't look bad. This looks like a really good dark chocolate fudge frosting on a chocolate frosted donut. glass and forgot it. Mmm. Sweet chili. It wins again. This is phenomenal. I recommend anybody to try this. Good. wrap this up don't forget to like share and subscribe share this out leave me some comments I want you guys to try this stuff and let me know what you think about it fantastic <laughs> but don't forget you are watching Derek VS and you never know what's next What are you doing? Why are you recording me again? <laughs>